Work it quick, erase it, write it, cut it, paste it, save it, load it, check it. Quick, what up, Pete? So, you guys probably want to know what the fuck happened to Cubs? Well, um, this is my first official, like, real hardcore video of 2015. Why does it look different? Well, I'm on a fucking webcam. Yes, yes, I know. It's a fucking webcam. But I have a really good excuse. I'm moving. I'm fucking moving. I'm out this fucking apartment. Gone. Slowly but surely. We're looking to be into the new place come the beginning of March. Uh, as of right now, slowly packing up. Slowly getting my shit together so this way we can get the fuck out of here. Mm, yummy booze. So, here's the deal. That's why you're looking at my nose. I'm using a webcam. Uh, also, these are some of the other things that I've, I've been doing lately. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. And some of this. Maybe more of this. So, yeah, basically, I've been really fucking busy. I work full-time job, guys. I work full-time 40-plus hours a week. And, you know, I do this on my spare time. So I really want to say thank you guys for sticking it out with me and being so fucking patient. If you guys hear music, I decided to put music. That's what the cool people do, right? I think that is. So... First thing I want to do is give a shout out, big, big ass shout out. If you guys are looking for wire, pick up, uh, check these guys out. I'll have some links below where you can pick some up. Modwire. Modwire is the official sponsor of today's video. All the wire for all the builds is done by Modwire uh, today. And uh, look forward to more Modwire in the future. They also supplied the cotton. It comes with the mod wire. Here, let me open this one up. Cotton and wire. I think you get like 10 feet, maybe, maybe not. I think it's 10 feet. But it's a bunch of wire and cotton. So, uh, yeah, check them out. Reasonable price. Good wire. I can tell you, for some reason, I, I'm pretty sure it's just Canthal, but maybe it's the pretty packaging and everything. But I swear that it heats up faster than than standard like Canthal. Uh, so today, in good faith, I've got a few companies that have been on me. They've been on me for a while, and I've been trying to get my shit together. You know, it's hard to juggle all these things. So in good faith today, I'm doing uh, five, one, two, three, four, yeah, five different juices different juices, different companies all together. I'm going to leave links below. These are like the ones that I picked out. Uh, remember, I don't vape any of the juice before I'm ready to review it. And so if I don't have time to review it, then I haven't vaped it. Okay, yeah. By the way, packing sucks. So I'm actually going to start with... Uh, the the lightest of the flavors to the strongest the reason being is uh the strongest of the flavors knocked me on my ass i loved it loved it but it was strong as hell so i'm gonna start with the lightest so this way i don't fuck up my taste buds the first one is fumy boomy now honestly labeling and everything this is clearly a sample uh Saw these guys at a few different places. Met them first originally at VapeCon. Then I saw them again at Vape Nights in LA. Uh, and, oh, I met P. Posardo. Here, here's a photo. Me and P. Posardo. Sorry, it's going to focus in and out. Sorry, guys. Cryptoburr. Oh. 
Look at her. I had to do it. First video of the year. Poke some fun at Rip Tripper. Bet she still didn't doesn't know who the fuck I am. So, uh, this one's Beelicious. Now, Beelicious is really I want to say it's a really light milk flavor, but it's honey and milk. And uh, if you're Asian or uh, anybody that's cool and in the know, you'll know that. Uh, uh, milk and honey is, is kind of like a traditional, it's like been around for years and years and years, and I'm surprised this is the first one I've seen. I'm not saying there's not some out there, but it's the first one I've seen that's uh, for vape juice, and it's really fucking good. You can vape this all day in a tank, on a build. I'm actually using a uh, five wrap on three millimeter uh screwdriver from uh five wrap of the mod wire and it's so clean it's just it's not super super sweet it's so fucking delicious it kind of the the labeling kind of reminds me of a liquor store brand but they're out there. I've seen them. They're made in the USA. The guys are good. They 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 seem like really badasses, or they try to seem like really badasses. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You know who I'm talking about. But they're good guys. It's there, and it's subtle. It's something that you can vape for long periods of time, and this is definitely one of those flavors. It's honey. It's honey, it's milky, it's creamy, it's delicious. So, Fumi. Fumi, Fumi. Um, we'll call it Fumi. Fumi juice. Check them out. Link's going to be below. People should know I'm fucking recording. What's this full one? Oh, here's a photo. That's actually what about Belicious tastes like, is that, that photo right there. Just in case, I'll post it again. Yeah, pretty fucking good. Yeah, I love it because I can vape it all day. I really can. Uh... There's no aftertaste. Sometimes you get an aftertaste that kind of lingers and you, you can't get rid of it. But it, it's fucking delicious. It's great. It's fucking delicious. When I move, there's going to be more structure to my fucking delicious scale. Um, and there's going to be more like details about the individual juices, I swear to God. But like I said, this is a good faith that the people that have been keeping me honest, you know, all these brands that I mentioned today, they've they've messaged me on a regular basis and they've trusted me so much. Uh, I can't tell you how appreciative I am that they, they've put their faith in me and they said, you know what, Shane? You know what? Cubs. Sorry. I said my real name. Oh. Boo. They've put their faith in me, and they've said, you know what, Cubs, you say it's going to happen, we trust you. And I can't stress this enough. I tell you, I don't fucking bullshit. You know, my card says I'm not here to blow smoke, and I'm not. If I tell you I'm going to do something, I'm going to do something. It may not be right away, but it's going to get fucking done. And I expect that from any company I work with. Not to mention some bullshit companies that like to dick people around. Feel my wrath. That's what I'm saying. Freaking, you guys, bear with me. Moving on. These guys. I got these guys at uh, Vape Night.
I swear to God, I'm not going to be a talking head for much more longer. Much, much, for much longer. I hate uh, just being this head that talks and then a little photo. No. It's going to get better. It, I swear. I have a new workspace. I've got like double the size. You know, most of the trouble for me doing these videos is pulling everything out, record the video, then hours and hours of editing. No space. It's going to be better. Oh. So, this is underground. So, this is underground GTI. GTI. What is a GTI? Uh, GTI, I'm going to assume it says, means green tea infused. If you guys have ever had a chance to try green tea Kit Kats, which I have from Japan, and they're fucking awesome. It's so delicious. Green tea Kit Kats or green tea uh, infused anything. Green tea is a very delicate flavor. You can sweeten it and it's delicious, but if you over sweeten, then you lose the green tea, and it's almost like just getting uh, sweetener. But these guys have like managed to get that nice balance of it's a sweet vape, but it's not overly sweet, but it's green tea, and it's a great combination of the two. They've managed to, to balance it very well. Vapor production is great. Uh, it's been cold lately, so all my juices are really thick if they're high VG. So I can tell you this is a high VG. Uh, underground for this one. It's awesome. Awesome. Yeah, so again, like I said, these are the people that kept me honest. These are the people that I've enjoyed their juices. Uh, I've picked particular flavors out, hoping that I would like them and hoping that that they would uh, be a great combination to to a great eclectic uh, combination of juices for this review because you know it is really a half-ass review and I'm gonna be honest it's going to be a half-ass review just because of the situation where I'm at right now but it's gonna get better it's the beginning of the year new things to come new videos I might even try green screen what? yeah green screen I'll put like a green screen behind me and then I'll make it all black or brown yeah I heard you can make it all one color stupid anyways sorry for party rocking I'm waiting for some some old school like music that you guys long time ago I can still remember how that no here we go nothing but Orange County here This trip to Garden Grove. Wrong one. So let me turn this back down. Green GTI. I'm gonna assume it stands for green green tea infused. Uh, this one is a three milligram, which is a little bit lower than I normally vape. And I vape with nicotine because uh, I'm sure I could move on. However, I find that if you can make a nicotine flavor or a juice with nicotine in it and it still tastes good, that is 10 times better than just making a juice that's a zero milligram nicotine with no with, uh, flavor. Because nicotine reacts to... The flavoring it really does and it changes the flavor so if you can make something that tastes like a strawberry coconut I don't know if that exists but it sounds like it might be good strawberry coconut with nicotine and it still tastes like strawberry coconut then it's gonna be better than if it's just a zero 
And honestly, I'm sure there's more people out there that watch videos for my flavors with nicotine that still vape with nicotine than there are that don't. So uh, that's why I still stick with nicotine. Anyways, moving on. Previous guy underground. Links below. Yada yada. I hope I don't have any boogers. You guys can hella see up my nose. These guys. These guys. I don't even know where you can get these guys yet. I'll find out for you. And I'll make sure I'll, I'll put a link. But uh, these guys are... are are really su surprising I uh, got a company they hit me up they said hey we saw your your business card which they're all over Southern California if you guys see them beautiful mustache you know they're awesome hi BG Now, I noticed, because I have tried some of their other flavors, these guys have a lot of candy flavors. They're a lot of higher su sweetener. Um, they don't gunk up the coils too much, but they, they've got a high sweetener, uh, more of a candy taste to them. Badass with the swivel chair rip tripper. So this is lung candy. But pretty awesome. So this is lung candy. And this particular one is Buster Cluck. Lung Candy. I'm going to say they're up and coming SoCal juice line. Good juice. Very good juice. Uh, otherwise, I wouldn't have them in this lineup. Uh, this one is a tropical fruit flavor. Uh, it is very candy like, so it's very sweet. Uh, lots of sweeteners. I can tell you if it's in a tank like the Atlantis it blows it out of the water I love the Atlantis I was vaping this you can see what's left of it so half the bottle in about a day on the Atlantis sub ohm tank it's pretty cool yeah it's pretty cool I gave, I, I did some tanks, and I was like, eh, those are bullshit tanks. I don't like them. They don't vape like I want them to vape after dripping. And then I found the Atlantis, and I was like, well, holy shit. I can travel L.A., Orange County, all over the place, dra driving, and be able to vape no problem. So, Fuster Cluck. Fruit flavors, tropical fruits type flavors very candy-ish uh, very sweet vape but it is a very good vape very delicious definitely one that I would definitely give a try uh, please check them out I'm gonna link most likely to Facebook pages uh, so you guys can check them out on Facebook and then from there with all of these juices you guys can uh, decide where you can search for them or whatever. I don't want to be partial to any particular shop with one exception that's coming up. Uh, so I just want to let you guys know that's what's up. If I give you a particular website, that's because that's a direct website to them. So uh, yeah, Lung Candy. Check them out. I, I'm getting lost, guys. This is a big ass drink. Let's pull some fucking bullshit music out my hat right now. That will be like. Oh, Thank <laughs> you. 
I was in high school when this shit came out. I'm just saying. So, yeah. Check out Lung Candy. Thumbs up. The next one. Again, shout out to uh, Modwire. Here's somebody else that's really good with with their communication. Must vape. Must vape. Only three flavors. They've only got three. I could do. I've done the whole video on just these three. So must vape. I met them at EC. No, no, no. I met them at uh, VapeCon. Badass chick, tattoos, lives in Orange County. Wants to go to Disneyland with me. Let's fucking do this. So. Uh, yeah, she gives me three bottles. Number one, they got a badass mustache on them. Right? It's a fucking mustache, and it's badass. So, don't fuck up that bottle. This particular one is called Imperial. Imperial is a tobacco flavor. Ooh, tobacco flavor. But it's very subtle. You get more of the tobacco flavor, more like a RY4, uh, at a higher temperature. So if you're doing a hotter build, the hotter the temperature, you're going to get more of the RY4. The lower the temperature, you're going to get more of the caramels, more of the nutty flavor to it. And it is very caramely and very nutty. And it is delicious. So, by now you guys should know. Delicious, awesome, they've done it very well. And, um, yeah, that's about it. And that means it's badass. Just go out and buy the juice and try it. Got this on my. Oh, here, let's do it this way. Ada Mod. Uh, Ada Mod really appreciated my video. Previous video. Uh, they sent me a custom mod with my, my name on it. They got a new lower economy version that's coming out, or it has came out already, actually. Uh, it debuted at uh, Vape Night. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm hella congested. But this next flavor is going to kick that ass. So... Must vape. Uh, they're out of LA. Shout out to. I need to make sure I, I give this shout out because uh, this is the only reason I got the juice. And I want to make sure that they hear this. So, a uh, shout out to Elevated Vaping. Elevated Vaping is not necessarily the distributor that I know of, but they're the ones that made sure that I, I got these these juices. So I want to make sure that they hear this, and thank you very much. We do appreciate it. Here at Flavor Strainer, uh, here at Flavor Strainer by uh, me, myself, I really appreciate it. Let me turn this shit down a little. That shit's annoying after a while. Sorry, sorry, guys. Sorry. I hope you guys can hear me okay. So, uh... Elevated Vaping, thank you very much. We do appreciate it. I'll make sure to, to leave a link below so this way Must Vape can uh, get the link and, and you guys can too. Uh, another just random shout out to Smiley E-Liquid. And uh, I swear by their raspberry. 
swear by it. They're vanilla. Their vanilla has got me second place in a couple of cloud competitions uh, every time I've used it. So, just saying. So, must vape. Badass juice. Check them out. Imperial, once again. And this last one. This one, like I said, knocked me on my ass. This is called Dragon's Spit. Dragon Spit. Oh, you guys see this? I, I need to make sure I, I give a shout out to the Tool King. The Tool King. Canadians rock. All right. So the Tool King, we've I've known him since he was just the king. Uh, so, uh, which has actually, I've only known him maybe a year. But uh, the Tool King, we've been talking back, back and forth, and he started making box mods, and they're sexy as hell. I just want to show you that. Sexy as hell. This isn't a review of the box, but it's pretty. Oh, I am no longer congested. That's how congested I am. Mono nostril. So, BLS. These guys. These guys have been on my ass like white on rice with milk in a snowstorm. Serious. They hit me up on a regular basis and they say, hey, what's going on? What's going on? How are you doing? Uh, you know, what's up? Let us know. Just talk to us. And that's what I've been doing. And, and, and I think I've been doing a very good job at it. Uh, this particular one is an apple. Some people say apple. Some people say kiwi. I find it to be more of an apple-ish, but it is hella menthol. If you guys love menthol like that, clear your nostrils, clear your sinuses. You feel very, very refreshed, very cool flavor. It's not menthol, minty menthol. It is just uh, that ice cold cooling sensation. This is the shit. And that's why I let's save this for last, because this will clear you out and it'll leave that cooling sensation for a little bit. The Tool King, by the way, he started making box mods for sale. So I'll leave a link below. Check him out. He'll do custom work. So, VLS, Dragon Spit, their line is about four juices big. Uh, I haven't tried their other juices, but I was vaping this for a while, and I enjoyed it. I, I like the cooling sensation more than the menthol, per se, like where it's straight up like it's real menthol with the minty taste to it. Great juice. Definitely check them out, VLS. Again, I'm going to have a link below. And again, this is a good faith video. I want to make sure that people know that I'm still fucking here. I haven't got anywhere. I'm still Cubs. Maybe a little bit lighter. Skinnier. Can you guys tell? Probably not. So, uh, I'm on Weight Loss Fitness Challenge 2015. Muscles and losing weight all right so uh this is my my food aversion uh i want an apple pie vape a fucking apple pie uh i want milk and honey vape milk and honey i want candy vape freaking lung candy so i want to make sure you guys know i'm still fucking here you guys i'm still here hit me up facebook twitter instagram whatever you want 
tell me if I'm not somewhere where I gotta be. All right, guys. So uh, I need a new outro. I'll tell you what. Brand new shirt. Boom. This is uh, E-Juice to Die For. So brand new E-Juice to Die For, 2XL. Brand new 2XL E-Juice to Die For t-shirt. Vape on Vape Heads is my 2014. But I need something new. And don't say sick as tits. Uh, I'll punch you in your fucking tit. And then your esophagus. I'm just saying. I need a new outro. You guys tell me my new outro. Twitter, hashtag Flavor Strainer, my new outro. Hashtag Flavor Strainer on Instagram. Tell me what my new outro should be. Hashtag Flavor Strainer on Facebook. Just send me a private message or post it on my Facebook group, Flavor Strainer. Uh, but you guys get it done. All right? So for now, vape on vape heads. <laughs>